Hi, my name is Herbert van der Sompel and I would like to give you a preview of an extension for Chrome that my team at the Los Alamos National Laboratory is developing. The extension implements the Memento time travel for the web protocol and its main developer is Harihar Shankar. Let's start with a search in Google. And since this is all about time travel, the first thing that we're going to do is actually set the date for travel. And we go to the uh, date picker here, and let's just say we select something in 2012. Why not the 24th? And we set that date time for travel. The fact that we did so becomes uh, visible when we right click in the page here, we get a Memento submenu, and here you see that the date that we selected in the calendar becomes available for travel. It means that we can look at pages and follow links subject to the daytime. Let's have a look at the first search result here, which is the IMDb page for Memento the movie. And we see that the current ratings are 8.6 and that's based on 536,000 uh, votes. Let's see what that was like in uh, December of 2012. So we right click on the link and we're asking to see uh, that page uh, sometime in the past. The Memento protocol does its work and we find the result from uh, the Internet Archive and we see the rating was the same. Uh, and this was based now only on 466,000 users. And the other thing we see here is that the page that we retrieved, we asked for December 24, 2012, we got December 23rd. Now this information is also available on right click because the internet archive is fully Memento compatible. And so down here, you see that the archived page that we retrieved uh, dates uh, 23rd December 2012. Let's go back and do something similar with the Rotten Tomato page for Memento the movie. Let me follow that link in the present. So I'm just clicking this and we see here now that the ratings are 92, 92. Uh, look at all the social network information that's available here. And so again, we're going to right click and we're going to see whether we have an archived copy of this page around uh, December uh, 2012. And indeed we do. Here's the result again. It comes out of the Internet Archive and we see that the rating was 92 and 93. And you see also that the uh, social network information was displayed in a quite a different way. Let's stay in the Internet Archive and follow this link here to mystery and suspense. That basically means that we're going to retrieve within the Internet Archive an uh, page of around uh, that time that we were at and we see that the result that comes back now is dated uh, November 26, uh, 22nd, 2012 and the results we see are Wake and Fright, Argo, Taken 2, uh, Skyfall. Now I observe that November 22nd, 2012 is quite a bit removed from December 25th. So let's see whether we can do better uh, by asking for uh, this page again. Oh, and we find something in uh, early 2013 now, and we see indeed different movies, uh, Skyfall, Sleep Tight, and there's again Skyfall, Kingdom Softly, and so on uh, and so on. Let's go back to our search results because I want to go to our Memento uh, project page and follow the link here to demo. So I'm traveling in the present, obviously, and this is the page I want. This is a page that we've been operating since 2009 and on a daily basis these images change and get the date stamped. You see here 2013-09-09, uh, same thing here 2013-09-09 and you also see that the, at the bottom of the page we have the daytime uh, of it. And so this page is being proactively archived on a daily basis and that means that I can do the same thing here and see what it looked like in December uh, 2012. And here we are, we see uh, the page as it was December 25th. 
2012 and you see that the images date from uh, around the same time. Now down here in the page you see uh, links to external pages. Uh, this one actually leads to the web archiving page in Wikipedia. So obviously if I click it I get the current version of the Wikipedia page. Let me go back and I could actually now right click it and you don't see what's happening in the screen here but I'm right clicking it and actually I'm asking for an old version of the page and indeed I receive a page dated December 4th 2012. I can keep browsing now so let's follow uh, the link in the past now for the World Wide Web topic. And that is being uh, retrieved now. We are. This is dated December 23rd, 2012. Now, mind you that because uh, Wikipedia is not natively Memento compatible, we don't get the daytime information uh, here in the right click. Uh, the reason is that the HTTP response headers from uh, Wikipedia do not include the Memento daytime HTTP response header. Still, through some proxy solution, we are still able to travel uh, back in time for uh, Wikipedia. And so obviously we see links to uh, Tim Berners-Lee here, but also to Robert Caillot, who is actually is a Belgian uh, colleague of the early days of the web. And let's follow that one here in time. And again, we find an old page uh, about Robert Caillot dated, in this case, October 22nd, 2012. So let's scroll down here in search for external links, of which there typically are quite a few in Wikipedia pages. Yep, here we are. And so, hey, how about this one here? Uh, this link here, the 12th one. So let me click it in the present. And we find a 404, so let's go back and let's see maybe when we follow it subject uh, to the time we set, whether we can find an archived version of that page. Oh, and that's interesting. Actually, the archived page uh, itself uh, is a 404, so it's an archived 404. So how about we get creative here? Uh, this kind of here suggests that this is something about around 2010, although there is no date time. I'm going to go back to my date picker and I'm going to, how about I set to January 1st, 2010 and see whether we can follow this link now, subject to that date time. Here we are. And again, Memento is doing its work. Yep, and we are successful. We find a page that is dated uh, March 29th, uh, 2010, which indeed talks about the Iren Prize Git on Robert Cayo. And here is uh, the information. Let's go back and see whether there's something else uh, interesting. Oh, here we are, Robert Cayo's website. So why don't we follow that? subject to time so we're in uh, January 2010 now yep and we find a page that is dated uh, January uh, actually dated December 21st 2009 where we asked for January 1 uh, 2010 now something I haven't shown you is that it is possible in a Memento compatible system to also from here directly navigate to the current version of that page which is what we do now. And here we are. This is the current version of uh, Robert Caillou's page. And another thing I have not shown you is that it's also possible with here get near current time to find the most recently archived version of this page. So now we're going back into archives and trying to find the most recently archived version of it. And that's this one here. And as we can tell, uh, the archival day time is 13 November uh, 2012. Well, this concludes uh, the little preview of the Chrome extension for Memento that we are developing at the Los Alamos National Laboratory. 
I hope you have enjoyed uh, the movie and I hope you will download and actively use the extension when it becomes available. Thank you.